Hello, hello, my name is Nick, a.k.a. Grizzly Mantis, and we are back in standard with something a little bit different, a little familiar, a little different, something old, something new, something borrowed, something blue. We have, I started off by originally just trying to do an update to the, um, you know, the artifact aggro, all that glitters, but when I was going through the artifact list, I saw Lucky Clover, and I thought, can we make Lucky Clover work in colors other than Teemer? I started looking through, and the thing that caught my eye was actually animating fairy. If you haven't seen this, and I'm not going to lie, I, I didn't even realize this existed. For three mana, bring to life. Target non-creature artifact you control becomes a 0-0 zero, zero artifact creature, and then turns into a 4-4. Four, four. Not bad. Not bad at all. I mean, that seems pretty decent, especially if you copy it. So then we started off on the task of, all right, well, we have our lucky clover. We have what we want to copy. What else do we want to copy? Raisin Borrower, solid pick. Definitely a hangover from Teamer. Fairy Guide Mother, not bad either. Two mana for plus two plus one flying for two creatures is quite the value. And that's actually it. But that's a lot, right? That seems like enough. That might be enough. Let's find out if it's enough. So the rest of the deck... Oh, man, the only thing I just realized I'm missing is... How do I forget Emery? Can't forget Emery. There's one. Hmm... Maybe we can forget. No, let's not forget Emery. Oh, there's two. I want the all that glitters. What can I cut? One more card needs to go for this Emery. No, two, you know what? Two's fine. Two's fine. We'll keep it at two. I'm hesitant to even cut the Guide Mother. I don't want to cut any more glass caskets, but yeah, let's go with this. So the idea being calling it Automated Machines because we're make, we're dropping things, Shadow Spear, Witching Well... Uh, glass casket golden egg lucky clover itself we're turning them into four fours and we're turning things sideways we got brazen borrower to clear the path and all that glitters to make things big fairy guide mother to give the evasion for the final blow alongside shadow spear for that sweet sweet trample and lifelink not to mention shadow spear can just turn into a big four four and start attacking that way too so that's the idea now although i have a sideboard built it's not the worst actually wait that's an old sideboard yeah disregard all right i guess we're going best of one <laughs> all right let's hop in and see how it goes all right all right okay why not we got the clovers and a double clover into a, a triple borrower will buy lots of time so let's do it what's the worst that could happen right who knows maybe we'll hit land ideally we go lucky clover lucky clover Oh, no! Unfortunate. Well, that's half of what we want, so let's clover it up. Hmm, this will be interesting. The lifelink will come in handy, but... Yeah, sure. Ow. Glass casket. Let's keep it up. What's the worst that could happen, right? Uh, what are you asking me here? Oh. <laughs> no, I'm not going to make my permanent, my opponent's permanents lose anything. Do appreciate it, though. It's like planes, shadow sphere. And I'm like, yeah, I know. Yes, I'm auto passing my turn. Why is it not auto passing? Yes, I'm not going to give anything, anything here. Yes, auto pass. Oh, auto pass. Uh oh. Rimrock? Rimrock. Oh my lord. Yes, dude. I'm not doing anything. <laughs> Another Rimrock? All right, so you're saying I made a mistake by not... Uh... Oh, jeez. Ow. Ow. Yes. Well, the best, best card to draw would definitely be a land at this point, but we'll see. Jeez. Yep, yeah, that's pretty good. Like a glass casket and triple brazen borrower, which is looking like what I'm gonna have to do. Wow. Well, that was a turn. Yeah. Oh. I mean, we're here to do something, right? Or should I just wait a turn? I get glass casket, bounce, bounce, bounce during its combat step. <sighs> yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. We'll aim for the uh, animating fairy next turn, turning all threes into creatures and hitting them back for 12. Can't let him go to his combat, though, because otherwise we risk Embercleave. Torbran, eh? Well, that's problematic. I gotta bounce that, too. 
Jeez, all right. Oh, uh, definitely got to bounce that first. Yep. Bounce that. Take four doing this. Bounce that. I mean, we don't have to. We don't have to attack with it. I might do this too, just so it stops bugging me. Stop bugging me. He's like, why'd you do that? All right, now I'm at four. Jeez, yeah. I'm dead to the triggers, aren't I? Unfortunate. Well, we almost had something cool going. Because now he just attacks and kills me. Because he plays the Torbran, uh, Scorch Spitters. We could Glass Casket a Scorch Spitter, but then we just do nothing. So, you know what? We're just going to do it. Do it, Anakin. Do it. Could have been cool. Could have been cool, bro. Could have been cool. Yeah, three mana for three four fours isn't the worst. Uh, uh, Tally ho! <laughs> not bad, right? Not bad. He's like, yeah, it's not bad, bro. I'm just gonna play the Torbrand and attack. Not giving you the satisfaction. <laughs> hey, that was cool though. Gotta admit, that was cool. Mono red. Oh yeah. All right, so. <sighs> Turn one, Gingy. Turn two, Golden Egg. Draw a card. Turn three, hopefully animate the Fairy Attack. Yeah, okay. Hmm. Not the best, not the worst. We got Fairy Guide Mother. This could be decent. We shall see, though. Stone Coil on the back end. Stone Coil is really just here for efficiency reasons. It could probably be something else. Boop. Run, run, run as fast as you can. You can't catch me. I'm the gingerbread man. No, I'm not going to play Stone Coil for zero. I appreciate it, Arena. I do. But it ain't going to happen. Stop trying to make it happen. So, Gingy. Come oh, on, straighter. Ooh. Ooh. Interesting. All right, that's pretty good. Well, 100% going to offer the trade. Take it. I don't want to deal with this all seed. He's like, hmm. Yes, indeed. That's yeah, just golden egg. Let's see if we can rip something good. Uh, nah, nah, not yet. So at least next turn we can animating fairy on the egg and attack for five. That's not the worst. Ooh. Oh, enchantress. Okay, Gingy, holding back. Glass casket, not the worst either. So, animation time, baby. <laughs> I didn't even know this card existed until I just randomly saw it and was like, oh, dude, sweet! We almost had the perfect curve last game, except mono red! If I had one, you know what I could have done? No, I didn't have the fourth land drop, did I? Darn. I was saying I could have animated the two Lucky Clovers and then equipped the Shadow Spear and gained four to survive. But, oh well. Maybe I should put more Shadow Spears based on that. So I don't have to animate them. We'll see. It's a 4-4, four, four, dude. Block or don't. The choice is yours. Next turn, we can Glass Casket and Fairy Guide Mother on the Ginger Brute. What, what are you doing? It's like, what are you thinking of doing? He's like, hesitating. Don't gut shot me, bro. Let me just replay the Fairy as a 2 2 flyer. Ooh, it's a Test and Champion. I like it. Get in with the Spinner. Go to the Owl Seed. Nah, no blocks. <sighs> All right, yeah. I guess what we'll do is we'll just glass casket, get rid of this champion while we can. Use Gingy's ability and say, "Run, run, 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 run as fast as you can." Pow, poo. Pass. No, yeah, that's it. Fortunately, this deck doesn't play anything multicolored, so. These stone coils, we might want to put them in for something else, but we'll see. No, not banishing light. Yep. Anything else? 
Ooh. It's going for Sentinel Eyes. Sentinel's Eyes. Unfortunate. All right. Getting in and out. Ow. Back up to 10. Hmm. All right. Let's see what we got here. Don't need another Jinji. Hmm. Could just go Fairy Guide Mother on the Golden Egg. Use Ginger Root's ability to smack for seven, but then we get smacked back for a hefty amount. Hmm. It's not the worst, though. Yeah. Yeah, it's not the worst. Bump. Yeah, actually, you know what I think I'll do? I think after this, let's take out the Stone Coil Serpents, since they're kind of not doing much with our jam. We'll just replace them with more Glass Caskets, and maybe... What kind of card draw could we put in here? I don't know. Card draw seems risky. He's at three, though, so... No! Not another Banishing Light! All right, Gingy. Now I regret putting the other one on the bottom. Non-creature. Another All Seed. All right. It's going back up to five, so we need something good here. Otherwise, we just play the animation fairy, animate, and attack again. Not looking too good in the shape of things. Ideally, um, the best draw would be another glass casket. So we can glass casket the champion, play the guide mother, Guide Mother, give the Ginger Brute um, evasion and attack. All right, what do we got? Lucky Clover. Very Guide Mother. Can't be blocked. Oh, I'm at three? Oh, dang. I didn't realize I was that low. Huh. I should have. Well, no, never mind. Well, there's a, there's a way we can sneak in something here, I'm sure. Or we die horribly. Yeah, we need more glass caskets. <laughs> Plain and simple. Maybe we should be going more in on the animating fairy plan. Oh, trample. All right, you win. All right, so took out the four stone coil serpents. I put in, uh, of course, uh, where was it? Uh, maxed out the glass caskets and a third shadow spear. And then I just did two gold globes. Figure that this is the closest thing we're going to get to more card draw. So I like Emery at two. I may get rid of all that glitters. We'll see. Yeah, actually, we're just going to straight up do four gold knights. Take out the two. Yeah, yeah, I like that. Take out the two, uh, all that glitters, and just make it four of each to keep the cantrips a rolling. All right, let's hop back in. All right, here we are again. Opponent goes first. Well, we will keep. It's a little meh, but at least we got glass caskets, right? <laughs> glass caskets for days. We definitely need to find... Oof, I wish this temple was untapped, but that's okay. We definitely need to find our animating fairies. But otherwise, not the worst. Yeah, I'll keep it. it. Does stuff. I'm sure whatever my opponent's up to won't be too crazy. Cauldron familiar. I stand corrected. Well, if we're lucky enough to glass casket that thing. Oh, I don't need you. Hmm, interesting, interesting, interesting. Let's see, if he gives me the opportunity, I will 100% glass casket that thing. I doubt he will, though. Maybe he will. Oh, all right, he will. Oh, hit the witching well. Get rid of the cauldron familiar while we can. Ow. Cool. Yeah, just gotta do this now before this thing has a chance to just come back and make our lives... Unbarrel. Maybe I should put sweepers in here, but hmm. now nah, what fun would that be? Whoa, Strider. Whoa, Strider. Oh, the whoa, Strider. All right, we'll probably just go ahead and unless we draw something sweet, eh? Let's go witching well. Let's scry two, and then I'll just glass casket the whoa, Strider. We'll probably sack the goat. Yep, scry, 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 scry. Three cards in hand. What could they be? Uh, I don't want either of those cards. Thank you. Yeah. OK, 
Okay, get rid of the Wolf Strider. So next turn we got Shadow Spear into either Guild Globe or Glass Casket, depending on what opponent does. Just sack the goat, dude. Just sack him. Sack that goat. To sack or not to sack the goat? Well, that is the question. There you go. Get that goat out of here. Okay, does not like what's on top. That's nice. You gonna sack the Fen Lurker too? Do it. Do it, Anakin. Do it. Come on, sack the Fen Lurker. You know you want to. Or just time out. Eh, you know, I can complain. Aw. It's gonna be a no to both, dog. If he doesn't play anything else, then I definitely want to go with Globe, try to hit this third land drop. Or try to find any of our little enablers, our four leaf or our lucky clover, our animating fey, anything. First thing we animate is Witching Well, obviously. Don't want him getting any of his critters back. And then we go from there. Problem is we're running out of things. No, nah. We're at 17, we got time. We got time, not of a time. Four cards in hand, three cards in hand. So what would we not want to see? Nightmare Shepherd is probably the worst thing to see. With our weird, janky... <laughs> weird, janky list. Ah, going for the pump plan. I can dig it. So I'm going to be down to 15. Yep. Keep it up. What else you got for me? He's like, hmm. Timer. Timer shrinking. Boop, boop, boop. Okay, he he switched phases. It's the fetch, dude. It's the fabled passage. They want you to fetch. Just fetch, bruh. Fetch. There you go. <laughs> Just turn him sideways. Just do it. Just, just attack. Just turn him sideways and attack. Three cards in hand. What could they be? I'll take it. Oh, man. <laughs> Killing me small with this timer. Oh, this timer. What can we do? All right. Ooh. Ooh. Wow. Burn the hands. We're two in the bush. All right. We're going to go with the globe and hope we draw the land. I want the clover, but it can wait. We got to hit these land drops first. Oh, man. Just fetch and get it over with. Just play the... Just use the fable passage. <laughs> yes, just do it. Then all your problems will be solved, man. I promise you. At least for a turn. Swamp. All right, perfect. Now you can auto pass. What? Do you have something in your hand too? Oh come on, dude! You're killing me. Let me draw my card. Let's see if we can hit a land. Let's see if we can hit a land. Only running 23 land, but it shouldn't be a problem to hit. What does he have in his... Okay, see, that's not so bad. Let's go Temple. Let's see if we can hit our Animating Fairy to start beating down. Again, we have two non-glass casket things to animate, should, so that removal doesn't give him his threats back. Probably just, just going to throw the Shadow Spear out here and hope we can find... I love you, Gingy. I do, but I kind of am looking for something right now. I might... All right, Shadow Spear, and pass. He's probably like, man, are you actually going to play Threats? This deck doesn't play Threats. Cool. Gray Merchant. Gary making his way back. Gary. Oh, just a cauldron familiar. Okay. Pump, attack, I'm down to 12. You got it, brother. One more thing to Glass Casket. Ow. Anything else? Well, that's closer, I suppose. Let's cost four. That just adds colors. That does nothing, too. So, yeah. Just going to go ahead and follow our plan. It's like, what is going on? I feel like there should be like a dance of the manse or something coming, but there isn't. I'm going to hold the... Oh, I should not have held the island. If he plays another Fenlurker, I'm going to be ticked. And now we can double pump? Oh no, maybe I should have hit that. 
One o'clock, boys. One o'clock. I'm on the Finn Lurker clock. No. Oh, no. <laughs> uh. <sighs> this is the scary best thing I could play. Nah, I'll wait. I'll wait. I'll pop it end of turn. Man, Fen Lurker beats. What a way to go. Another Fen Lurker. No, not my island. Yeah, that's fine. Bye, island. Down to seven. Yep. You got it. Yep. Yep. Ow. Anything else? Nope. Eat some food? What? Draw, draw. Come on, animating Faye. We need you right about now. Close, I suppose. Oh, boy. Two, three, four. I'm at three. Oh, lordy. Lordy, why? Why? Where are all my good draws? Anything? Nothing here that draws cards? All right. Any of our things will do, except probably Fairy Guide Mother. So we have eight draws to do some stuff. At this point, I would even take Ginger Brute. Ginger Brute represents life. Life. It's probably like, are you going to do anything with these Lucky Clovers? And nah. Nah. We don't do anything in this deck. We just play artifacts and hope you scoop at some point. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. All right. It's going to be down to three. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, boy. Hmm. Mm-hmm. Jeez. Come on, deck. Mm hmm. Yeah. Keep hitting pass, and you keep thinking I want to do something. Oh boy, better late than never. Does that even matter at this point? Well, actually, yeah, it does. So I'm gonna gain four this turn. Hit him for twelve. Yeah. Then I'll get to replay. No, I will. Yeah, actually, I will get to replay because I haven't played the land yet, have I? Nope. Perfect. Oh, you. It's like whoa. I do something, I promise. You. You. He drew it. He drew the card. He drew the card that did stuff. Uh, oh, no, I can't. If I equip, it costs two. I always thought equip costs one. Well, I need the life. Uh, Let's see. Yeah. <laughs> we do things in this deck. We do things. Great Merchant. Oh, Fen Lurker. Oh, no. Oh, wait. I don't have any cards in my hand. Ha, 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 ha. Yep. Oh, we do things. Roar! Get in there. Oh, we do things in this deck. Oh, what's he got? Well, dag nabbit. Oh, wait, he hit the... Okay. I think that's still lethal. I could be wrong, though. Okay, quick at instant speed. Oh, he's got more stuff to do. No! 
Well, darn. We almost got there. But hey, at least we... Weird flex, but... Ah, ah, yeah! Yeah, 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 yeah! <laughs> all right, all right. Awkward, but... We got Gingy, Shadow Spear, Golden Egg. We'll keep. What's the worst that could happen? He's down to five anyways. Maybe he'll scoop. Doubt it, but maybe he will. Okay, maybe he will. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. This is everything we want to be doing. Which, well, Lucky Clover, all of the above. Let's see what we got. Okay. Ooh. Yeah, totally. Now all we need is our fairy. But we have time. No, uh -oh. Temple of Triumph, you say. Hmm. Methinks he wishes to foil us. Debating if there's a world where I cast the Emery this turn. Nah. Because then next turn I can go uh, Lucky Clover, Emery. Depending on what opponent does. This could be... I don't know what this could be. Ah, Knights. Very good. Okay. That's the case. Let's start with Emery. Hopefully we don't hit four Fey. One, two, three, four. Shadow Spear. Eh, not bad. Shadow Spear and a Witching Well. So Emery has stuff to do. I should go for the Witching Well. No, I have to go for the Shadow Spear because well, we need the blue mana. Especially since we're going to be bouncing things for like the next 10 turns. Oh, nice. I hope this doesn't bite me. Pow, pow. Poof. Nope. Yeah. Let's just go and get the Shadow Spear up here. And then we'll pass. Just bounce his board. Go Breeze and Borrower mode. Hope he plays something else prior to attacking. Otherwise, this is going to get awkward. Come on. One more threat, dude. One more threat. Oh, no. I'll just wait till his combat and bounce the token. Yay. We got there. But I have a feeling he'll play something else. Perfect. Looks good to me. <laughs> Scoops of the brazen power. Meh. All right. Okay. Again, not bad. We go turn one Gingy. Turn two. What are we on? We're on the draw. Well, we'll see. Might be turn one Gingy. Might be turn one Witching Well, depending on what opponent is. Tranquil Cove. Huh? That's the case. Let's go Gingy. Hmm. Although, without all that glitters in here, maybe Ginger Brew should be something else. Huh? Charming Prince. Uh -oh. Blinkies, huh? Blinky, blinky, blinky. See what he does with the scry. I look. <sighs> Come on, Giblet. Two on top. Hmm, nice. Okay. Oh, let's see. We're not going to be getting in here, so let's just go with Golden Egg since it's the best of the bunch. I'll draw a card. Another Gingy. Uh, no attacks. Yeah, I should probably. Yeah, yeah, we should probably take the Ginger Brutes out for something else. But what? I don't remember if there's anything that says like search your library for an adventure creature or reveal the top four or something like that. Oh, total blinks. Blink power. He's got emo boy and everything. All right, well, start off with the witching well. Scry anything not named Lucky Clover or animating fairy to the bottom. All right, now well, we're getting there. No attacks. Hmm. Got an emo boy, and now he might just throw a Thassa at us, and then we are in trouble. Elite Guard Mage. Not bad. So far, his board doesn't beat the 4 4 plan. I'll uh, we'll go no blocks. Although, I don't really want to execute said plan until we get a Lucky Clover. Well, let's try for the Clover before the Thassa makes its way out. Brazen Borrower, not bad. It is nice, isn't it? Um, Bounce the token and be like, eh. Buys time, I suppose. Yeah, it's Gingerbrooped. Hmm, 
bounce the token or just block the token. Yeah, I guess we'll just go ahead and yeah, let's try to find that. Uh, we really need to find that lucky clover to make this work. Nope, no love, no text, no pass. Now Gingy's going to block something because I only want to take four this turn. I don't want to take more than that. I really needed that four leaf clover. Oh, oh boy. All right, Gingy. What can we replace the ginger brutes with? Because I love them, but at the same time, they don't really serve a purpose in here. Very guide by. They're not the worst. Okay. Well. Yep. Let's just go ahead and animate one of these guild globes. And then we will go ahead and pass. Holding up Brazen Borrower for something. Probably an elite guard mage. Or, yeah, elite guard mage. Not the best plan in the world, but that's okay. There's Thassa. Take our beats or bounce. I think I want to bounce the Thassa, but then we take our... Yeah, that's going to be painful. Who? Yep, down to five. So now we're banking on Shadow Spear. Nope, don't need you. Yeah, that one. If I give him a seven, I hit him for seven, I'm back up to twelve, two, four, six, nine. It's gonna take a lot more than that, but what other options do we have here? Man, we really need the clovers. So what we need is we need to take out the ginger brutes and bring in more ways to find lucky clover. What other ways are there to find Lucky Clover? Emery. Emery's a way to do it. Could play more Emery's. Charming Prince, sure. Hmm. One top, one bottom. Sure, 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 sure. Nice. Maximum bounce. Got it. Hmm. Two, two, one, one, three, one. We can draw two cards. How much mana does that leave us? Three. Oh, that's enough to gain some life. We got life. We got gain life powers. Yeah, let's do it. Let's draw some cards real quick. See if we can find something better. Oh, you know what? I got it. I know what we need to do. We'll replace the Ginger Brutes with the Time Raveler. Let's us play Animating Fairy at instant speed. I have Death Touch, do we now? So I think what we do here is we attack. I imagine I'll trade with a Charming Prince and a... Yep. Okay. Yeah, I like that idea. Mm -hmm. Kill them all. Burn them all. Boop. Back up to 13, buy a guild globe, and let's just go. So let's see, play, block, negate, or negate, take four. Then hopefully we can rip. Yeah. Then hopefully we can rip a uh, lucky clover to get a pretty decent swing in next turn. We gotta deal with Thassa though, which is uh, annoying. The Time Raveler, sure. What are you gonna bounce? Bounce the Gingy? The Shadow Spear? Yeah. It's whatever you want, Mike. It's weird that you play that over Thassa. I feel like I'd rather just play Thassa. Maybe he thinks I've got some shenanigans. Some instant speed shenanigans. Yeah, Shadow Spear is the only thing I can't sack, but then again, that's probably the worst thing to bounce because it doesn't actually do anything. Mm, yeah, well, he wants that card. I can't do anything about it, so let's see. 
Uh, loses indestructible and hexproof. Okay, sure. Be whoop. Draw your cards, sir. Uh. Hmm. Sure. Tack, 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 tack. You scared of my gingy brute? I didn't think so. And let's eat him. Mm -mm -mm. Yum, yum, yum. All right, Lucky Clover off the top, baby. Lucky Clover off the top. Lucky Clover off the top. That's a witching well. Close. Close. All right, how much mana do we have? Well, six more. So three, six. Yeah, that's enough for everything, I suppose. Gingy. Spear. Fairy. Quip. Take out that time, Raveler Gingy. Get in there. Uh oh. Who's he going after? Brazen Borrower? That would suck. Yeah, Brazen Borrower does kind of poo in our parade. Nah, it's another time twist. Sure. Just gonna eat the ginger brew. And then take. But, oh, it comes back end of turn. <laughs> I thought it came right back, but that was silly. Alright, cool. Just doing it to do it. Alright, back up to 14. Yeah, that's such. I like Gingy. I like Gingy, but without the all that glitters, oh, pfft. without the all that glitters, we got nothing to do. But the good news is, we can just start playing these things, start blocking all of his flyers and whatnot. Shadow Spear makes our stuff pretty decent. Three, six, ten. We're gonna be down to four. Yuck. Banishing Light on the Shadow Spear, I assume. Oh, that makes it tougher. It's okay. We take a hit this turn, and then let's see, three. We have seven mana. Ow, ow, ow. Sure. Glass Casket. Glass Casket deals with the Charming Prince, deals with all sorts of stuff. But what else do we got? The Raisin Borrower. We can do two of our things. Or it's three fours make this a little tougher. Hmm. Life Gain's on the table, too. Can't forget about that. All right, let's start here. Let's just see if there's... Let me see if there's any hope. Is there any hope on the top of the library? No hope. Don't need either of those cards. Okay. Then I guess we'll just go... Brazen Borrower. Very good, my other. Glass Casket. Uh, I guess that one. It only matters when it doesn't. Now we got some chump blocking to do. Yeah, maybe the fourth shadow spear is not a bad idea. No, three seems like a good number. They are legendary after all. Yeah, we can do some chump blocking this turn. Oh, but not this game. Oh, well. Yeah, I like this plan. Let's go ahead and do this. All right, all right. Okay, well, we've got stuff. We've got more stuff. Let's do this. We got the animating fairy. got the time raveler. What we need is a Lucky Clover, but we have the Emery to find it. How's six looking opponent? Okay, and a Witching Well. Hmm, we don't want either of those right now. We want Lucky Clover. Breeding Pool, hooray! Yeah, we can go Emery. Gives us four more looks at Lucky Clover. No lucky clovers, but we got the egg. We can cantrip. We got stuff to do. Ooh, soul tie. Oh no! Why would you do such a thing? Oh, gross spiral. Looked like he was. Hmm, meh. All right, let's make sure we get value out of this emery immediately before we lose the ability to. Unless we rip lucky clover, of course. Nope, that's a brazen borrower. Okay. Uh, yeah, let's just play the golden egg. Draw 
card. It's an island. Play this guy tapped. Pass the turn. Okay, we got the fairy. We just need the lucky clover, and we'll be rolling. I could have just gotten in for four there, but it just didn't seem like the best of plans. Swamp. Five cards left. Soul tie. Could be bad for the home team, because they play good cards. Aww. Maybe he'll be like, what's this guy up to? Yep. Read each card carefully. They are all good. <laughs> he can't help it. Can't help it. Take the time, Rappler. Leave the card on top. Oh no, we did have the Tyrant Scorn. <sighs> well, in that case, let's kill the Globe. And let's Lucky Clover. Perfect. Setting up for a big turn next turn. Let's just hope we don't get, uh, you know, Daughter Erasure again, because that would suck. Otherwise, we go Animated Fairy. We animate the two, probably the Well and the Globe. So good at this game. So good, so good, so good. All right, now we're looking for another fairy. Because I imagine if my opponent's... Oh, look at that. What are the odds? Man, that would have been sweet. Oh, well. Nope. Cute. All right, we'll just hold up uh, either Brazen Borrower or we'll pop this Witching Well end of turn. We don't need it anymore. Euro. Sure. Yep. Yep. Anything else? No? All right, cool. Gobble, gobble, gobble. More of the same. Oh, there's Shadow Spear. All right, we'll go Witching Well. Let's do some scrying. There it is. We can set it up for next turn. Let's go Shadow Spear. And I got the fairy on top. So I guess we'll just pass. And flash in the Brazen Borrower end of turn for additional meat. And we'll attack for 12 next turn, or at least try to. See what opponents got, though. Oh, it's a Nissa who shakes the world. Sure. It's not scary at all. Mm-hmm. Can't bounce lands, unfortunately. Mm-hmm. All right. This guy. <sighs> sure. How about this guy then? Yep. Anyways. Oh, unfortunately. Hmm. Let's get them both. Okay. Kill the Nessa. Get the opponent. All right, all right, all right. Now we're cooking with gas. Euro's coming back, though, but Euro can't stay for long because I got a brazen borrower. Yep, attack first. Sure. Negate. Does make sense. Oh no, not my guild globe. Anything but my guild globe. Three cards, opponent. Come on. Either bring the euro back or I don't know. What if? Hey, it's a euro. I wonder if that last card in his hand is like a disfigure. Problem is, this plan is going to cost us our brazen borrower because the first bounce will resolve, the second bounce won't be able to. Witching well. Hmm. Well. Cards you got left. One. Okay. 
go for the scry. Time Raveler. Okay. Bye, Brazen Borrower. You're cool, but unfortunately, you're too cool for school. Yeah, that stinks. Unfortunate, but get in there, pow, poof. Take that. Take that. Giving them back the euro is kind of annoying, but at the same time, it gets it off the board. Yep. Yeah. I'll be at 15, sir. A euro and four cards. Which is me and my team of jank. Cavalier of Thorns. <laughs> What's he hit? Nothing. He hits a Temple of Malady, as I imagine he'll take. The rest can shoot. But now Euro is definitely coming back online next turn, so we gotta win. Let's see if we can. Looking for another Fairy Guide Mother. It stinks because there's only two. Would he draw another negate? That would stink. That would be the end of us, because this has reach. Oh, jeez. Trample, lifelink. Okay. Yeah, that's it. Well done, opponent. Well done. All right. Okay, definitely. Kind of wish we had our Lucky Clover, but eh. Start with the Temple. Don't need another one of those. Turn two, Golden Egg. Turn three, Witching Well. Guild Globe. Yeah, Stomping Ground. i do this quick. Because we're going to die pretty quick, I imagine. Okay. <laughs> yeah, just put that on the bottom. Scry bug. All right, well, follow the plan. Yeah, follow the plan. Hmm. Old teamer, eh? The egg out. There's the clover. Now we need the bay. Ooh, what could it be? Oh, Euro. Mm, probably either reclamation or something similar. Well, we'll go lucky clover. Let's see if we hit our land by Euro. Mm-hmm. 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 All right, what do you got? Shadow Spear. That's not what I wanted. Uh really need to hit this land, so we're gonna witching well. We're gonna probably go guild globe. Um actually that's not terrible. Yeah, that's not terrible at all. Get the free scry out of the deal. Now we don't need a land. Now we're looking for our boy. So Oh, is that another choo choo coming? All right, let's see what you got. Oh, it's an Ilgar. Oh, boy. Hey, Glass Casket, you don't actually do anything here, do you? Oh, boy. Well, we're going to go Lucky Clover. Shadow Spear. Oh, whoops. I didn't have the land. Oh, terrible. All right. Let's see what our opponent's got. <laughs> Did not mean to play the Shadow Spear. Meant to Brazen Borrower. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Here we go. Opponents running on all fours. Oh boy. Uh, let's see. So that's, uh, yeah, that's lethal. Adios, amigo. <laughs> all right. So the Brazen Borrower should have been played uh, instead of the, yeah, that one's on me. All right. Well, again, absolutely. We don't have our animator, unfortunately, but we do have ways to find it. And there it is. Uh, actually, you know, we're going to keep both. Guild Globe. Draw it. Play the Emery. Needed to put the plans on top so then I could Guild Globe draw the Emery. Ow, oh, boo. <sighs> yeah, that was bad. Man, it's not playing bad. It was so bad. I meant to put the plans on top. Draw the plans. Play the plans. Play the Guild Globe. Draw the animated fairy, play the island, play the emery. That's how this turn should have gone. Unfortunately, we have to do this, which is a much worse. Oh, wait. It's only turn two. I'm, I'm retarded. Nope. I'm special. That's the word. Special. Barkhide troll. You got it. 
You gotta remove it to get the, okay. Well, at this point we are just looking for, yeah, at this point we are just looking for our uh, Lucky Clover. Oh, two animated fairies, really? Brutal. Let's just go Shadow Spear and pass. Dang, ouch. Uh, no, well, yeah, no pass. <laughs> Hex proof and indestructible. That's hilarious. Shadow Spear could actually do something this match. Probably not, but it could. Like Glass Casket and a Bark Eye Drill is nice. And then response that Shadow Spear. Ooh, how sweet would that be? Would be pretty sweet. Uh, no blocks here. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Yep. And my turn. All right, not the worst, not the best. Uh, let's see here. Well, just might as well get that witching well out here. Yeah, I like both of those. Next turn, we play Teferi. We, we draw Teferi, we play Teferi, we bounce something, probably the uh, Incubation Druid. And then we draw Lucky Clover. You know what? We need that land. Do we need what do we need more? Teferi or land? We've got the Brazen Borrower already. I'll tell you what, let's just let's do it this way. So then we can, if we don't want to Brazen Borrower now, then we can, yeah, okay, that's it. Yeah, 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 we'll do it this way. If we had the land, it'd be different, but we don't. All right, uh, do we want to play anything? Nah. Yeah, we'll hold off. Still no artifacts to be used. What do you got for me? Nisso shakes the world. Sure. Yep, that's a Nissa. I love how it says auto passing, and yet it keeps giving me priority to do things. It's like, homie, I'm auto passing. That's what that means. Replays the troll. Or not. Doesn't matter to me. Can we kill the Nissa? Uh, yeah, plus two, two, four, six. Yeah, we might be able to. Hey, it's a Leafkin Druid. Sure. All right. Now oh, I regret keeping that Time Raveler, but we'll do this. I can't do that yet, but I can do this. Well, I guess I can't kill it. Thought I could, and I was wrong. That's right. I thought. I guess I thought the Shadow Spear magically equipped on its own. Yeah, you know, it's a common thing. Now I wish I'd have not kept this Time Raveler on top, but I did not anticipate a Nissa. I was thinking more hexproof and less Nissa. Now, next turn, we got to animate a well and a globe, and we don't have the mana to oof, equip the Shadow Spear, which is aggravating. Yep, making mana. Oh look, it's the Great End. <laughs> All right, fantastic. Fantastic. This is just going great, isn't it? Sure. Hmm. Maybe I should have held the Brazen Borrower and just taken three from the Bark Eye Troll, perhaps? Perhaps? Our jank is looking pretty bad, but that's what cards like this tend to do. Make it so that if you play anything that's below its power level, you're probably going to lose. Yep. Okay, fantastic. Anything else? No? All right. Cool story, bro. Cool story, bro. All right, we got a useless Teferi. Can't equip the Shadow Spear. Yuck. Oh, well. That's a Vivian. Okay. Sure. Emery's not doing anything at the moment, but perfect. Chomp, chomp, chomp. All right, anything else? No? Fantastic. 
Fantastic. All right, give me uh, the Witching Well and the Guild Globe. Let's just. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Never give up. Never surrender. Let's play the Guide Mother, because why not? Hey, blocks. Nothing wrong with blocking. Ah! We're just dead on the backswing? Yes. Yes, we are. He's probably like, okay. Do it. All right. Not dead on the backswing anymore. Goal achieved. One blue, two colorless. Destroy two target green creatures. <laughs> Yorbo. Sure, why not? Mm hmm. Opponent's still at 22. I'm still fighting over Anissa. Fantastic. Sure. I'm at 8. Okay. Mm hmm. Those creatures game trample this turn, don't they? Yeah. Oh, it's a Paradise Druid, because why not? Sure. You're going to have the Great Hinge. You might as well, you know, make it work. Make it do its thing. Use the Vivian on the Incubation Druid. Just go ham. Full ham, baby. Of course, Team Beast. Okay. <laughs> yeah, that's enough of that. Okay. All right. Well, we got the components. We got the Time Raveler. So... Turn two cantrip, turn three something. Sure. Man, I'm just... I must just be in a mood to take a beating today because, wow. Oh. Only thing that would make this better is if turn two or turn three, somewhere in there, we drew a lucky clover. Then we'd be in business. Fable Passage Pop, you got it. Temple of Epiphany, let's see if he finds a Plains. Nope, ooh, Grixis, interesting. Emery, not bad. Next turn we can either go Time Raveler or, okay, never mind. What the? And it's not Grixis, it's five color. Ooh, Niv-Mizzet, niv mizzy that'd be sweet. Another Guild Globe, hmm. So I care about his Time Raveler, I don't think I do. I think I'd rather just go Artifact. Draw Lucky Clover. Nope. Emery. Fine Lucky Clover. That's the name of the game now. One, two, three, four. No Lucky Clover, no artifacts. Unfortunate. It's probably like, what in the world? I know. It's pretty sweet. You like getting your face beaten in mercilessly. Yeah, I didn't hit artifacts. Unfortunate. All right, Mabel Passage. Pop. What's he going to do? What kind of crazy shenanigans is raw fish up to over there? Mm-hmm. Mountain. Sure. One white source away. A white and or green source. Euro. And you guys are not getting janky enough. Sure. Another shot at that. Uh... Yeah. Nope. Never mind. Oh, boy. Hmm. Well, we should go double cantrip. That, yeah, stinks, but we really need to find, really need to find that lucky clover. Come on, clover, where are you at? Get him. Get him. Get him, get him, get him, get him, get him. All right. Emery, you got there, buddy. You were awesome. Shimmer of Possibility, maybe? Maybe that's what I should be playing instead of Time Raveler. Shimmer of Possibility to find... Uh... Oh, no, not my Emery. Anyways, Shimmer of Possibility to find... Victory! <laughs> Fair enough, I guess. All right, so we're trying now with Shimmers. Okay, well, we got Temple. We got a Guild Globe. We got a Fairy. Sure, all we need is our clover. I put in, uh, I cut the two time ravelers and one guild globe for three shimmers for this game. Let's see how that works out for us. Uh huh. Hmm, let's go temple. Oh, 
No, nah, I think we'll pass on the island. If we don't need it, we probably shouldn't go for it. Wall of Runes. Interesting. I like what you're up to. Oh, man. Please be... Oh, what do you call it? Um, high alert deck. You know what I'm talking about. Uh, the one that lets your creatures with Defender do stuff. Ugh. The standard Walls deck. Omen of the Sea. Interesting. Wall of Runes kind of kills our 4-4 four, four plan, but at least we got Fairy Guide Mother. Next turn, we'll be able to Witching Well. Let's see if we can find that freaking... It is high alert! Oh, I love it! Oh, I gotta build a high alert deck. Note to self. All right, we're going. That's so awesome. Witching well. All right, we need neither of those cards. We need a lucky clover. ASAP. I would settle for a high alert. I love it. I would settle for a ah, glass casket. Ain't bad. That'll at least keep us moving. Next turn, we Shadow Sphere, and then probably just Animated Fairy. Can't wait forever for this thing. <laughs> Fantastic. Narset. Aww. Oh, wait, I'm out of cantrips. That's fine. So what I'll do is I'll Glass Casket this Wall of Ruins. Ow. And then attack the Narset. Oh, I can't do that. <sighs> I guess I could take four one more time in order to do this. So we'll go Witching Well. Don't need lands. And then let's just go ahead and bring to life that. Poof. And next turn we set up for glass casket and shadow spear. He's like, hmm. I see you jank too. I jank as well. It's jank time, baby. Although I like what you, the jank you're playing here. Oh, boo. Yeah, at least we'll get to draw a card. All right. Boo. Ow. Not what I'm looking for. All right. Let's go. Gil Globe. There it is. We don't have the fairy yet. So we don't. We can still go with the glass casket plan, so we don't die. Don't need another shadow spear. Now at this point, we're looking for gobbly goop. At this point, we are looking for another animated fair, animating fairy, or a time raveler. Holy crap! Are you serious? He didn't attack with the wall. That's interesting. I thought it was dead there. Holy crap! Are you serious? What can we do here? We can glass casket the wall and then just play the animating fairy. Yeah, I mean, what choice do we have? We're going to take six if we don't block. Yuck. Alternatively, take six no matter what. So we could just try to draw two. Yeah. Let's get rid of the token before he remembers it can attack. We go for the draw two plan. We take six. We're at two. Um, oh, we got to hope for a fairy. Yeah, yeah. Well, no, because we don't have the... Well, yeah. Because then we can go two, four lucky clover, one, two, three, four the fey, and... Yes. That is the plan. Sure. Gain two life up to 22. Which is going to be something crazy. Oh, wait, no, I'm dead, aren't I? Yep, that's right. So it's toughness. So that's a 12-12. Derp. Well, let's see if we... Well, I'm going to draw my next two cards and just see maybe if it would have worked out, but... derp de derp 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 Yeah, we should have played a wall of mist. Yeah, sure, dude. I think I'm dead, but that's cool. Oh, that's toughness. All right. Six, six, draw two. What would we have drawn? Nope, no love. Nah, we're dead anyways. Let him have his victory. <laughs> Needed a... Man, there was a lot of things. A Brazen Bar would have been sweet. Oh, I got to build a high alert deck. That is awesome. <laughs> oh, it's got everything we want except for lands. It's the perfect hand. <laughs> Uh, can't keep having lands. All right, we'll keep this jank. Oh, let's get rid of witching well. Turn one temple. 
Oh, that's fine. We'll at least know we'll get to three mana, so we can turn two golden globe, or excuse me, guild golden egg. Turn three witching well globe. We got the casket, not bad. Jungle Hollow number two and Cauldron Familiar. All right, now we got a casket. Apparently the deck wants us to casket. Unplay the. Uh, I don't want either of these cards. We need some of our any of our little combo pieces, anything. So it's Glass Casket, the Cauldron Familiar, and keep on the Cantrip Train. It's like budget food, maybe budget Jun food. That's not bad. Not bad, and I did something. Draw. Keep. Nope. That's it. Hmm. Brazen Borrower. Okay. Giant of the Elysian Grove. Okay. Cool. Hmm. Interesting. It gives me something to bounce, though. Bagoo! Bagoo! Mew! Not what I was hoping for. Alright, we're just going to go island. We're going to pass. Pop this Witching Well to draw some cards. nice man we're all playing the jank today i love it perfect let's get this on the battlefield let's get this on the battlefield let's find our animator mm -hmm. they can wait Hold up the Brazen Borrower so we can bounce this bad boy and whatever else he plays, even if it is just a lazy and dooby doo. Dooby dooby doo! Bolas' Citadel! I'm in love. Opponent, I love your deck. You play Bolas' Citadel. I want. I gotta make that card work. Like a Turbo Citadel deck. Oh no, come on. We need something here. His, his Citadel is not gonna be so kind to us. Oh no! Before I got no cantrips left. Crap. Mm, come on. All I can do is flash in a brazen borrower. How lame is that? Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. No, not my lucky clover. Don't I? I'm also over my lucky clover. I need that. Okay, cool. Setting up, setting up. You got it. Gives me something to casket. Okay, dry to the Elysian Grove. All right. I like this. I like the sauce here. It's pretty sweet. All right. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Get that chick out of here. Yes. Let's do it. Do it, Anakin. All right, give me this. Give me this. Yes. Pow, pow, poof. All right. And play the lance. We can flash in the brazen borrower and pass. We did it. <laughs> we got there. Oh, boy. Every lance shoots me for two. And you can play multiple lands a turn. No, not the borrower. Why would you do such a thing? Pretty sweet, actually. Man, this deck's sweet. Bower. Shimmer of Possibility. Not a bad draw. Shimmer into Shimmer looking for another fairy. Yeah. Oh, yeah. What else am I going to do? Bounce the Dread Present? Pfft. We're here for a reason, people. Aww. I'll take a Shadow Spear, though. Yeah, it's fine. Does make it. No, it still makes it so that. All right. Let's do it. Kill that dread person's ASAP. And uh, what's this one? I have any color? Nope. Not doing any of that stuff. He's still got that citadel, which is straight up terrifying. Aww. Cool. That's pretty bad, too. 
Going after the spear or the borrower? The borrower. Good choice. Yep. Now he's got that, which is sweet. Not going to lie. We're going to be able to kill the Dryad and the Braska. Oh, boy. Still at the Citadel. Yeah, we got to kill that. No ability to draw cards, so we'll just play the Fey. Pass the turn. All right. Just got Citadel and six life. What can we do? Here we go. Nice. Keep going. Okay. <laughs> nice. Ooh, you scry to the bottom. All right, here we go. What do you got for me? C -c 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 Combo, two lands. Oh, this is so sweet. Another dryad, sure. Boom! Nice. Nice. That's very nice. All right, so let's wrap it up. Was this janky? Yes. Was it too janky? Probably. But it was pretty sweet. I definitely think as we went, things got better. The Shimmer of Possibilities definitely should have been here the entire time. Not sure how I forgot about that. Because uh, it really is like, we need Lucky Clover and we need Animating Fairy. But the rest of the deck kind of facilitated that. Maybe we just get rid of the Time Raveler. I'd love Time Raveler, but then we can go... The fourth Shimmer and the third Emery. It kind of looked like that. Oh, yeah, I could dig that. It definitely felt like... I mean, it was a cool idea. Like, getting that... It was such a thing. Turn one with... Like, the dream, I'll say. The turn one Witching Well or Shadow Spear. Turn two Clover. Turn three Fairy. Attack for eight. Or, excuse me, Bring to Life. Attack for eight. Would have been pretty darn sweet. We didn't see it that often, but we did have a couple sweet wins where we were able to just animate and swing. Especially that one game against... Uh, hmm. Who was it against? Eh, there was a game. Oh, Mono Black. Against Mono Black, where we just, like, animated everybody and just crushed face. So, again, this is jank, but it has potential to be more. I like the Animating Fairy. Turning our stuff... Animating Fairy and Lucky Clover was pretty sweet. Brazen Borrow and Lucky Clover, we already know that's sweet. There's something here, maybe. Maybe what we should do is go, like, uh, Fires for, um... Fay of Wishes? You know, we could on three, three... Fey, wish for it. Eh, that seems janky too, but that's the right kind of jank. Maybe Jess Guy, Jess Guy, Fiery Fey. Hmm. Automated machines could make a comeback later, but that is all for now. I will see everybody. La Tour, and as a note, stay safe, stay inside, stay antisocial. <laughs> Hey, you made it to the end of the video. Thank you. I appreciate it. I hope you enjoyed the games. You want to show me some support? Go ahead and like, subscribe, follow me below. On Tuesday and Thursday nights, I go live. I'd love to have you stop by. Also, the Discord below. You want to hop in there? Give me your two cents on this list. You want my two cents on your list? I'm always open to talk about this stuff because I love this stuff. Otherwise, I hope you enjoyed. I hope I see you when I'm going live. Otherwise, I'll just see you LA Tour.